Hello and welcome to QDBindoEducations.blogspot.in In this video I am going to show you what are the different special characters uh, that are used in regular expressions in QDB. So regular expressions are very important part uh, we can use the regular expressions in descriptive programming as well as object repositories. So it is very important concept uh, the, uh, in QDB. So in this video I will show you what are the different special characters and how, uh, and how you can use those uh, characters in uh, regular expressions. So let us start uh, with uh, the characters. So here is the list of those special characters. Now the backward slash is indicates that uh, next character would be a special character literal or the back reference. The next is uh, caret that is input string should be matched at the beginning. And the last one is dollar that means the input string should be matched at the end. Star uh, matches the preceding character zero or more times. Or it is equivalent as opening uh, brackets zero colon and uh, closing bracket. So star means that uh, preceding character zero or more times plus means that uh, preceding character one or more times question mark indicates that preceding character should be zero or one time then you can also specify um, uh, uh, that uh, if you want to specify that previous character should be matched exactly n times then you can use uh, in the brackets n or i then uh, if you want to match the previous character uh, at least i times and at the most n times you can uh, use this syntax curly brackets and that then uh, parentheses are used to uh, capture the matches and that can be used in the back references then if you want to match either uh, per two characters then you can use uh, p uh, pipe q then if you want to uh, match any uh, character from the character set then you can use the brackets and then if you want to uh, match any uh, negative characters uh, said that means any character except these characters you can use this syntax B bracket square brackets then uh, caret and if you want to specify the range of characters you can uh, use the uh, this syntax p colon uh, dash z that means starting from p q r uh, until z so that characters will be matched and uh, similarly negative uh, range characters can be specified then you, if you want to match the boundary of the word you can use slash b if you want to match the middle part of the word you can use slash capital b if you want to match the digit you can use the slash small d if you want to match non digit character you can use the slash capital d you can also match the form field characters new line or the carriage character using slash f slash n and slash r then if you want to match any white space character like space type form field etc you can use uh, slash small s and if you want to match any non white space character you can use the slash capital S if you want to match horizontal and vertical type characters you can use slash T and slash V if you want to match alphanumeric character including underscore you can use the slash small w and if you want to match any non alphanumeric character you can use slash capital W and slash 1, 2, 3 can be used to uh, reference uh, back uh, use, used in back referencing of the captured matches. So this is how you can use the uh, regular expression characters in uh, QDB. Some examples are given here. Suppose if you want to match a 10 digit mobile number you can use slash t and in the brackets 10. That means uh, a digit will be matched 10 times and then to match email address you can use slash w plus at slash w plus dot slash w plus. That means alphanumeric characters followed by at symbol then alphanumeric characters followed by dot symbol and then followed by alphanumeric characters so this is how you can use the regular expressions uh, to match particular patterns in the given string thank you